Hi there everybody, my name is Heratoga and welcome back to our survival season in Vintage Story. I love how this area looks at night time. <laughs> Could do with some more lighting. Alright, today I think uh, we deserve to go off and have a bit of fun. So we're going to go and visit those ruins today. <laughs> I've made some spears. Uh, I've made some arrows, and I've made a new bow. Uh, I'm trying to make a recurve bow. Uh, I've made the shafts for them, but they need to dry out. So let's go and see how much longer we have to wait for those. Oh, I thought I'd hang up that banner on the end there. Uh, I think it was in the way a little bit here. <laughs> uh, Andrea in the comments was asking if we could hang these on the walls and we can uh, I made them in such a way that they can be stuck to the walls or hang off ledges so I think it looks pretty cool up there <laughs> could do with another one on the other side just for symmetry yeah so these two staves let's have a look how long have they got left oh 21% dried Mm. Well, soon we'll have two decent bows. Uh, also, I put a plug stopper in the sink. Uh, and that's a suggestion from Colin McDonald. Thank you, Colin. I think that looks a lot better than just a hole there. <laughs> and I've also made these cupboards usable. Uh, by accessing the chest below it and that is a suggestion from Sparky Fox thank you Sparky I think that's awesome now we can use these cupboards <laughs> so we have a chest under each one there and I made those shelves a bit thinner alright so we better get ourselves ready uh, did I put my bow in there yes i did because i made a new one so I'll stick that there i made some copper arrows today so we've only got 30. Uh, i could do some panning and get some more arrowheads but i want to get a, a load more bony soil before i do some panning uh, and, and the, the copper arrowheads are easy to make anyway uh, and copper's like everywhere really so Right, let's grab our chest a stick it on our back. Uh, let's check bouncer, make sure his weight's not dropping. No, he's still got decent weight. Nice. <laughs> okay, let's get to the blacksmith. And grab our weapons. Man, we need that armory so we can get the weapons from the armory instead of the blacksmith. Alright, I made four tin bronze uh, spears, so we'll grab all these. Uh, what else do we need? We need probably some ladders. Let's go and get some ladders. Oh, I'm pressing shift to run. I've, I've been playing another game where shift is the run button, and in this game it's control. <laughs> right, so we've got ladders... Uh, I don't need the torches on my hotbar. Is there anything else we need? Not that I can think of. Hmm. I think that's okay. I think we've got everything we need. We've got a sword, a shovel, a pickaxe. Uh, I don't think we'll need an axe, but we'll take one anyway. Right, if we, if we find any bony soil, I'll get the uh, the shovel out. So let's put all our weapons there. There we go, alright. So we're going to go to... We're going to go to... Where is it? Oh, there it is. We could go to the cathedral first, or this little village first. 
and there's a little ruin there. We could go to the little one first, then the village, then the big one, and then back home. We probably might have to sleep overnight out there, so let's go and grab our bedroll. I mean, we've got a fresh full day. It's 20 past nine in the morning, but just in case we're out too long, I don't want to fight drifters in that cathedral at night time because there's a bell in that cathedral uh, and when it rings it's probably going to summon some really tough drifters so all right let's get this little one pinned so we can follow that and uh yeah let's get uh let's get moving i've got, I've got some fresh food with me as well so we've got a pot of uh, full food. So we're not going to starve. I've got uh, the chest on our back. Yep, yep, we're all set. Food, storage, weapons. Uh, don't want to scare those chickens into the woods there. Speaking of woods, though, because we've got this chest on our back. Oh, man, if, if we come across uh, any bears, we're in trouble. <laughs> they sleep under the trees, so they can be hard to see. Having a bit of fun like this, it makes a change from building and mining all the time. Sometimes you've got to get out into the world and stretch your legs. Uh, and in real life too, if you're at the computer a lot, sometimes you just got to get out of the house and touch some grass, you know? <laughs> Gandalf says the world is out there, not in your books. Oh, some more cypress trees over there. That, I do have those marked on the map. That's, we'll just leave them for now. We've got a lot of ground to cover. <laughs> Aye, some of you wanted me to keep in the, uh, the adventuring like this. So I thought, you know what? I can do that. If, if it's what you guys want to see. There we go. There's our first ruin over there. That big spiky circle arrangement going on. <laughs> we may pop into the trader as well and see what he's got. Because we are on the hunt for glass. <laughs> Seems though you can't make coloured glass uh, in, in the game. Which is a shame, I think. Alright, now I know there's no monsters here, but uh, we've come for treasure. Let's get our pickaxe. I won't mind some of these books. Now in the new update, they've added glue, so you can like pour glue on these little bits of, of ruins, and then you can uh, harvest them and pick them up. But for now, we've got a, a chance that they'll break, or... A chance that you'll get you'll get to collect it. Right, that one just broke. Oh, come on! I want a pile of books. Yay! Thank you. Can I have another pile of books? Ah. Oh. Okay, we got two piles of books. That's great. <laughs> so all this uh, ruined stuff. I want to keep collecting this stuff because in our house that we're going to have that big house that we're working on. It's going to have a huge attic, and I want to put stuff like this uh, in the attic. So, uh, yeah. A ruined brazier. Oh. Can we have this one? Yay! Okay, a ruined cache. Oh, is this going to break? <gasps> we got it, yes. What about these candles? Nice. Oh, those ones broke. Hmm. An altar. An altar. And it would look nice in our house somewhere. I think we're going to need an axe for this, though, aren't we? 
Yeah. I don't think these break. I think you always get these. Nice. Well, we've got some little bits and bobs in these in these jars. 35 clay roof tips. <laughs> oh man. Got some lime, some clay, some sticks. Just take it all. Take it all. I want it all. These are nice jars too. Got a scroll. Got some compost. Some more lime and an ingot mould. I think we're getting a bit full, aren't we? Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna have to chuck that on the floor for a sec. Oh man. I may have to prioritise some of this stuff, like like sticks. We we can get sticks and and clay. We can get clay. Uh, we've got loads of coal, so I can probably chuck that. I know it's sacrilege. <laughs> And cattails, that's a good stack of cattails, I'm taking those. Uh, we could chuck that ingot mould, because we've got 20 of them. We don't need another one. So let's pick up our axe again. Oh, these altars, we'll put those in there too. They open to rift over there. Let's chuck those. Like that, there we go. Alright, now, let's see if we can get these. Yes! Alright, I think we're done here. There's, there might be something underneath. Shall we check? We'll have a little check. Because you never know. I don't know these rooms. Oh, it's, it's not looking good. Yeah, I don't, I don't think there's anything under there. <laughs> Let's just put those back there. There we go. Alright, next. Oh, there's a bit of copper here too. Hey! Might mark that. In fact, I will mark that. Copper. Okay, we don't need to pin this one anymore. Uh, so we'll pin this one. And before we go, we'll just uh, poke our heads into these this trader here and see what he's got. Yo. His name Hubert. Yo, Hubert. What do you got, buddy? Uh, huh, we can sell bowls of honey. Yeah, we need to get some baking done so we can sell. Because selling bread to traders is a good way of making money. Uh, he wants charcoal too. Hmm. But it's got halite for sale. Nice. <laughs> a hay bed. You don't need to buy hay beds, guys. Oh, he's got a wolf. I should have brought my money. No. And a recurve bow as well. Ah. Oh. When does he restock? Four days. Okay, I've got four days. Well, it seems like we've got two recurve bows. Uh, being created. I suppose I don't really need to buy one, but I do want to buy this wolf. We need a dog. It would be nice to have a dog. We've got a pet rabbit. I want a pet dog as well. But uh, yeah, if if you can place those down, I'm not going to place them down because I'm not sure if they turn aggressive. <laughs> so, uh, But it's nice to know he's got um, a wolf pop. Okay, let's get going. Right, I reckon. Should get it off now. And then we'll place it down over here. There we go. Let's get our shield out. And our stabby stick. Zoink. Uh now I know there's locusts up there in that room. So we're going to go everywhere, dispose of all the monsters, and then we can loot the place. Because these crates here, you can sell these to traders too. Uh, you get some good money for those. Uh, let's go around this way. Now locusts, they spawn from nests. 
and they'll keep spawning from nests until you get rid of that nest. Oh, two stabs, nice. Whoa! Oh, I hate spiders. <laughs> okay, we've got another one. Yeah, so I need to get up there, get rid of that nest. I think there's like two different styles of nests. You get cages, and then you get these like upside down spire looking ones. Look, stop. Just die! <laughs> Oh, yeah, if you're the clockmaker class, you can make a special spear and you can tame one of these locusts. And it'll be your little friend until it dies. I reckon we should get up there now, get rid of that nest. You get some uh, few odds and ends from these nests too when you break them. Oh, there's another nest over there. I think I see a cage as well. Okay, that's that one. Let's see if I can jump onto this. <laughs> can I reach that? Yes. Yeah, usually you find all these nests and locusts uh, deep down in caves. Uh, but this is the better ruins mod, so it's it's got these in them. Oi! Get this is my spot. Maybe I should block. <laughs> They're nibbling at me. How's my armor looking? Ah, oh, totally fine. The armor, should I say pajamas? Because. <laughs> All right. Oh, there's another locust there. Hey, hey, yeah. Okay, let's see if there's any more. Hello? Hello? Don't think there's any more. Let's go down here. Yeah, I think we're all good. Let's uh, let's put our lantern on. It's getting a bit dark. <laughs> Scrap axe. There's so much stuff. Yeah, I may have to like make a few trips. <laughs> Okay, what's in this? Oh, it's cracked. Oh yeah, because it's a food, a cracked food vessel. Okay. Pile of junk metal. Hey. Now I have died twice in this game. If I can pick that up, I can make a, I can make a grave, <laughs> and say that's that's my old dead body. An aged wooden bed. It lets you sleep for up to 9.5 hours. Oh, please let me have this bed. Can I have this bed, please? Yay! So we've got a 7-hour bed and a 9-hour bed. That's epic. Oh, wow. I love this stuff, too. I hope we can take that stuff, but we're running out of room, and I don't want to clog myself up yet, because we've got to go to the cathedral yet. We could actually sleep here for the night. <laughs> Is this a... It says helper. What do they do? Is it a toy? <laughs> Looks like a... A vintage story style remote control vehicle. <laughs> oh, there's a book on here. Can you read this? No? Okay. It's just a lectern. What's that? An armillary? Oh, a globe. I want that globe. Is that another nest? Oh, you've got to be joking me. I didn't even see that. Four nests in this one room. Wow. What's the cathedral going to be like? Okay. Got bits of rope. Let's drop down here. Pick up all these little bits. Oh, yay, we've got another skeleton. So that's both of my dead bodies then. <laughs> if it lets us pick them up, that is. Alright. 
Let's get our ladders back. Uh, what room have we got left? Metal scraps. You can make black dye out of metal scraps. So I need to keep collecting that stuff. Uh, put those metal parts in there. Nice. Yeah, we'll put that bedroll on our hotbar because we're going to sleep now. Should we just sleep out here? See what happens. <laughs> we'll get the nine hour bed. There we go. Plunk that down. Let's sleep. Hey, we can sleep with the stars. And we wake up and it's still stars. Nice. I love that. Let me press F4. Ah, yes. <laughs> Alright. Uh, it's four o'clock in the morning, so it'll be daylight in a, in a little bit. Alright. Well, we could see what else is in there. I've got some flax on me as well. Let me just chuck that in there. There we go. Alright, you know what? I'm going to prioritise what to take. I want these crates. Oh, there's 32 peat bricks in there. Has this got anything in? That's got five small pelts inside of it. Collapsed chest, what's inside? Pineapple seeds. I'll take them. For now. Uh, what's in this one? Four metal scraps. Yep, I'll take those. And some more metal scraps there. Yes. Excellent. Yeah, these open ones, you can't sell the... Uh, I don't think you can sell the open ones to the traders. Oh, more metal scraps. Uh, yeah, I could probably do these uh, buildings up, get them fixed up. So we've got a home away from home. <laughs> so have all these metals. Oh, okay, they're metal parts. What's in here? Blue clay roof tips. Another 50 roof tips. Oh man, you know what? They can stay in there. A large crate of junk. A crucible. Oh, more metal parts. Nice. You need metal parts to fix uh, translocators. Now, I broke my ladders, didn't I? But is there a way up there? I think so. You have to go in this place. There was a building next to this one. Did we go in that one? No, we didn't. Oh, oh it's waterlogged. What's going on in here? Metal parts, lots of junk, a jug, but it's empty. Ah, oh, that's a shame. What's this? A large glass tank. Ooh, let's see if we can take it. Yay! A seed vessel, another chest. What's in this? A ruined flanged mace. Oh, all these ruined weapons. A ruined base lard. Yeah, we can we can store those in our armory. Oh damn it, I touched it. Now I can't put it back in. No, I'm stuck with it now. Yeah, we can place all these ruined weapons in our armory. An embroidered collar. <laughs> yeah, I'm 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 not wearing embroidery, folks, so a copper bracelet. I'm gonna have to put that mace in my inventory now, aren't I? Uh, these bookshelves. Now, every time I try and collect bookshelves, it doesn't let me collect them, so I'm not going to break these. 
Yeah, they've got no books that you can pick up, which is a shame. Uh, that's a ruined... Oh, a scrap spear. Well, that can stay there. I like this table. That will look nice in our house. Let's let's move this jug. We'll put this jug. Okay, we'll put it there. We'll take this. Okay. Use pickaxe then. No, he broke. No. <laughs> no, no fair. I'm just gonna leave that door open. Okay, this is one building, although it does have a door. Oh, ooh, what's this? A ruined glass tank. Ooh. And a chest. Cooking pot, shepherd sandals, <laughs> flax fibres. Well, we need all the flax we can get our hands on because we need that windmill. Oh, because... Is there anything up there? There is. Can't quite see, but there is a, a farming vessel there. Hmm. Oh, there's another one of these tables. Let's see if we can get it. Okay, we've got that. Okay, we've got one more space. <laughs> Yay, we got one. Nice. Uh, I'm going to put that there for now. I'm going back for some of this stuff. It's just we're so full. I want to see what else is here. Oh, you can go upstairs. <clears throat> oh, yeah, we came upstairs, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, there's so much good stuff. There's so much good stuff. Oh, there's another chest there. A little sneaky little chest. What's this? A minstrel coat. You know what? I am going to see if I can wear some of this stuff. Yeah, there we go. Hey! Some money. I'm taking that. Another storage vessel. Copper arrows. Oh, we've got 11 more copper arrows. Bonus! Uh, I'm, I'm going to chuck those pelts. We'll take this vessel. Because that's a nice vessel, that. Uh, we've got some quartz. That can stay there. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. So much good stuff. I'm going to have to do many trips to bring all this back. But for now... We're going to go over to the cathedral. Uh. Because it is on the way home. There's no point going home to come back to go back home again. So let's let's save that. We've got some fighting to do when we get over there because of that bell. Uh, I'm going to have to drop something, aren't I, to be able to pick this up. Uh, I'll see X. Oh, you had to pick... Oh, okay. It went into my other hand automatically. That's cool. All right. Let's go, go in. Hope we don't find any bears. Like in the last episode, I was trying to go to our coal and there was two bears together. <laughs> Imagine getting chased by two bears. All right, here we go. Oh. So all I'm going to do here is um, destroy the locust nests and kill all the uh, drifters uh, and then we'll have to go home and find somewhere to put all this loot <laughs> all right Nine o'clock in the morning, we've got plenty of time to do this. Let's try and stay away from that bell, wherever it is. We'll take care of these locusts first. Okay, there's one up there. 
There's a nest. I'm looking for the nests. Oh, it's an oil. Oh, it's an oil liar. Okay. What, what the heck? I haven't seen a locust like that before. Tier 3? A tier 3? <laughs> Don't hit me! Oh, I killed it. Okay. That was easier than I thought. Oh, it's, it's just spawned again. There's a nest over there. Yeah, come over here. That's alright. Yes. Dang it, spawning. Ah, oh, they just respawned. But I need to find that nest. Oh, smeg. Ladders down real quick. Like that. Oh man, the hard to hit. Okay. Alright, oh, got the big one. Oh, there's another one already. Stay back. No, don't hit me. Now, where is that nest? Come on. What? I don't see one. But they're definitely spawning up here. Hmm. Did I bring my torches with me? I did. Well, let's put some uh, let's put some torches around here. It might stop them. This place is riddled. Hmm. I don't see any nests though. Unless they're hidden. There's a nasty drifter over there. Tier t what tier is he? Tier 4, yeah. Oh, if he hits us. <laughs> oh no, not shift to run. It's control. Okay, we got him. What did he have on him? Okay, okay. 
At least I took care of that guy. Oi, give him a spear. What? Why didn't that rusty gear stack with those? Weird. And this flax. Oh man, I wish those were set in to stop stuff going onto your hot bar when you pick it up. Now oh, I know there's a bell around here somewhere. I want it gone. I saw a shadow of a... Ah! Ah! <laughs> Three of them. Right, time to get a bow out. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. on it. Oh, they're so hard to hit. It's like trying to hit a pixel. A moving pixel. Eww. Right, I'm gonna have to stop getting hit now. <laughs> oh dear. So many locusts here. I was not expecting this many locusts, to be honest. Oh, you jumped, you little juker. Oh, man. I suck at throwing spears. Oh no, there's a saw blade locust. <laughs> the whole family's here. We need to take him out. You do not want that one to hit you. Yes! Huh. Well, no bell is ringing yet. Okay, is that a, is that a, that's a, that's a big one, isn't it? What tier is he? Four, yeah, he's a tier four. <laughs> These spears have to hit. check what he's got in a sec because if he's got any Jonas parts then uh, we need to collect those <laughs> he's got a temporal gear oh man well that P is gonna have to go oh. we can get P anyway you know it's not a it's not an issue Got a crawler. So we still need windows for our starter home. We need five more windows. Because if I if I decide to do this place up, I want to put stained glass windows in these instead of the normal ones. 
Oi, you stupid drifter. I'm trying to... <laughs> so let's see if I can make room for these windows. Oh, we did get a Jonas part. Nice. Yeah, I've, I've just got no room, have I? But where is that bell? Oh, tapestry! Hey! Definitely want that tapestry. Stab your butt. Get some ladders down. Okay, I'm worried that that bell hasn't sounded yet. Another skeleton. A tall vessel. Oh, more ladders. Okay, what's up here? Hopefully no saw blade locusts. <laughs> okay, we need another ladder. Parkour. Oh, we're going on up. Is that a tall vessel? Oh man, if I get whacked off here. <laughs> and a seed vessel. Well, this is going to give us a good chance to find any nests. I don't think there is any, you know. Yeah, I don't I don't think there is any locust nests here. And I don't see that bell. Another saw blade locust. Typical. We need to get down because if that if that finds us <laughs> We are in trouble. Ah, no! Okay, you know what? They keep respawning, don't they? There's something dodgy with this place. You snagged. Get some more torches down actually. Might help a bit. You know they're all gonna burn out, aren't they? <laughs> you sneaky little bugger. Die now. <laughs> right, let's see what this guy's got. Uh, just some more flax. Well, I don't think uh, we can do much here. I, I didn't see any much stuff that we could take. So I'm going to cut this one as a loss. We'll, we'll come back here at some point because we need to get some more windows. But uh, by the looks of it, all the locusts and drifters they keep respawning i don't know if the spawners are hidden uh for the locusts but uh that saw blade locust just disappeared did you see that it it just disappeared yeah there's something uh, weird about this place maybe that's why it looks the way it does all right Let's go uh, home. A par chest over here somewhere, didn't we? Is it over here? I can't find it now. Ah, oh, there it is. <laughs> Alright, 
need to make room to pick this up. Okay, let's go home. Awesome. <laughs> All right. Now we've got a great big uh, glass tank here. Let's just put it on there. Okay, let's get this chest off. Plonk it down. We've got a nine hour bed now, so we can put this down now. Nice. All right, let's, uh, let's get some food in our belly. No, not put it on the floor. Get food out of the pot. Thank you. Uh, get a little bit more out as well for next time. All right. Yeah, so we can replace these crates down. Uh, or we can just put them in here uh, so we can take those to the trader at some point and, and sell them. Might keep this one that's got the, the paper on it. Uh, in fact, I can put that in our cellar. Let's go and find a spot for it. Let's put it here in the corner. Yeah. So you can still use these. Uh, I think you can, yeah, you can put stuff in them. So that's pretty neat. You can make these crates too, by the way. All right. Well, you can't make the aged crates. You can make actual crates. That's what I mean. Yeah, we've got some cool stuff here. What can we do with this? Where can we put this? Hmm. How about in the corner? Okay, we'll just stick it there then. <laughs> ah, there's some resources here to put away. Um, I'm going to save this furniture and stuff for our other house. There's a scroll here. Can we read this? Blind Bat Rickhart, part two of eight. Oh, there's no point in reading those until we get all the parts. Uh, can we put this on somewhere? No. Dog on it. Hey, oh, pressing the wrong buttons again. Uh, we can put that temporal gear in here. It's a shame they don't stack. Uh, put that money in there. So we've got 40 gears now. I want to go and buy that wolf. I've got another Jonas part. So we've got three of those sub assemblies and we've got a temporal alignment node mm. yeah let's grab these gears uh, we've got a bunch of vessels too didn't we so let's let's place these down and have a good look at them There's all kinds of plant pots and planters and vessels that are all all different. Are these are the usual ones, obviously. Hmm, I like that one. I like that one. And they've all got the same storage space. And you can pick these up and, and put them on your back. If you've got the uh, carry-on mod, that is. Yeah, these look really nice. I think I might put this one over at the farm. Yeah. I'll keep these for our new cellar as well. Because uh, our big house is going to have a bigger cellar. It's going to have like an underground corridor with rooms on either side of the corridor. I think that'll, that'll be awesome. A nice big cellar. <laughs> okay. Right. What time is it? It's only ten past eight. Well, I suppose I'll see you folks in the morning. I'll try and sort out all these resources and uh, get them put away. 
uh, and then I'll see you in the morning. Wakey wakey, eggs and bakey. So, before I slept, I went back to the trader to buy a dog. <laughs> so we've got a pet dog now. Now, we need a name for our pet dog, so I'll leave that to you folks. Uh, can't wait to see your suggestions in the comments. Um, while I was there, I bought some halite as well. So, we have a little bit of halite now. Why am I holding my dog down there? There we go. <laughs> All right, so yes, we had a bit of fun. We went out to the ruins. We've still got loads of loot to uh, to go and bring back. Um, I may have to put a couple of double chests down just to store all that kind of stuff uh, away until we get our big house built. <laughs> but yeah, I think uh, that's all we have time for today. So I'm going to call the episode there. If you have enjoyed our adventure so far, then be sure to like, share, comment and subscribe. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comment section and I'll be sure to answer them. Until next time, goodbye. Woof. <laughs>